And to attend, school officials in South Carolina are also looking at ways to improve school security. Fox 46's South Carolina Bureau Chief Shakira Speaks spoke with the Lancaster County School Superintendent about what they're doing to make classrooms safer. The Lancaster County School Board is going through pages and pages of old board policy that hasn't been touched in decades. Now they're making a change to a policy concerning school security. The district says the use of metal detectors will increase as opposed to hand wands. District Superintendent Jonathan Phipps says this is all in an effort to prevent any potential problems. The old policy, it made it seem as though using the wands and we were looking for something. Dr. Jonathan Phipps says that's not the case. He says the new policy makes the use of metal detectors random. Most of the time, or 99% of the time, it's us being proactive. I asked parents on Facebook what they thought of the new policy. One Lancaster County parent questioned if metal detectors had positive effects. Her Facebook comment says, I've heard mixed reviews, including they're expensive, and they take a long time to get in and out of school. Dr. Phipps says they've had the detectors for about four years now. They're similar to the ones you see at a courthouse or sporting arena. Uh, but they're mobile. And so they actually can be moved uh, in front of doorways or outside even at that time. So it, it, it gives the availability to have folks to walk through speedily and, uh, and it's a little less intrusive than the wand. At the beginning of each school year or as new students enroll, the district says they will let parents know that metal detector searches may take place, but it's in an effort to make sure your children and the staff are safe from any potential threats. Reporting in Lancaster County, Shakira Speaks, Fox 46. Shakira, thank you.